for the rebels, the excitement of experiencing a new culture was not lost on them, and it's something they will remember for a long time to come. I know for me, I've never really ever been much of anywhere, but especially not anywhere like that. I think it was super awesome. I mean, anytime you get to kind of go out of the realm of Oxford and travel a little bit is great. I think it was great for all of us, especially great for our, our younger players on the team. And, and it's basically just being engulfed in softball for a week and then a pretty beach when you come back. It's a great recruiting tool for us, being able to take trips like this. You know, we've been to Hawaii, uh, we've gone out to California and Arizona, and now taking a trip to Mexico. is really a lifetime experience for them and something that they'll probably never forget. So that's really fun for us as a staff to, to be able to watch them experience that. The Puerto Vallarta challenge would begin for the Rebels with a tough Power 5 opponent in Texas. Ole Miss would try and get the bullets flying early. That one is ripped in the air to left field, deep, and that is off the wall. One run will score, making a turn around second and holding with the double is Schneider. The you know, two is ripped down the left field line and in for a base hit. One run will score. They'll send the throw to the plate. It is not in time. She does a great hook slide, and Castro's able to get that hand down behind the catcher's tag for the run. It's now 5-0. It's always good to start fast, um, especially against a good Texas ball club. I mean, they're a, they're a power five conference, so we know from an RPI standpoint that we needed to get the jump on early. We had Caitlin Lee going, so we knew if we could get <clears throat> one or two runs, um, we had a good shot at winning that ball game. It settles the nerves that you, that you have a little bit, not completely, but a little bit. It feels like smooth sailing for the rest of the game, so whenever we score first, we score so early, it just feels like that we're, we're on top with our hands on their throat rather than vice versa. I think it was a great, table setter just for how we wanted the rest of the week to go. That one swung on and missed strike three, and that'll do it. It's our final score here tonight, Ole Miss eight, Texas two. I love the way we sold the bats. We came out with a, with a little bit of uh, piss and vinegar from, from last week. And like Katie said, put the ball in the gaps and made, made plays.